Can't believe I'm making this video. Been avoiding making this video, but I'm gonna fucking make this video. Hi, I'm Caffeine Jedi. Also known as Stephanie. Also known as that girl from Miami who lives in Brighton. Though that's not an alias, but I am. <sighs> There's been a lot of uh, unpleasant rumors traveling about Richard the Dick Coughlin on YouTube, and um, I suppose I could give some perspective on this, being that I am female and have interacted with Richard in, like, the real world. Not, like, the YouTube world. I mean, like, the real world. Like, as in, stayed over at my house, lent money to, hired him on projects, uh, made YouTube videos, like, together, like, in the same room. So, let's see. I've known Richard for about four years, like, in the real world. And, uh, in this time, he has done one really fucked up thing to me. And that is to leave his gross-ass food in my fucking fridge. God, how could he eat the garbage he fucking eats? <laughs> I bet you were thinking something like, he must have sexually harassed you or sexually assaulted you because he's an evil misogynist dickbag who secretly hates women and just wants to grab their butts. <sighs> I'm a feminist. Yes, I'll admit to using the dirty word. I am. And... Ah, lights go back. You almost saw the real wrinkles. And, uh, in this, uh, being of me, you know, girl power, bullshitty, -y. I don't believe actually in girl power, I believe in equality, I know, like the dictionary version of that. Richard has never, ever in his entire existence of knowing me, like, and me as in, like, he stays at my house, and in fact is asked to stay at my house. Every Brighton Fringe, which is a rather long event for, like, more than ten days a pop, uh, of which I lounge around in my goddamn panties because it's fucking my house, has ever even looked at me, like, in a way that wasn't like a, hi, how are you? Like, that, like, never a remark. I mean, even once, I guess he, he, he once told me that I was flirting with another friend of mine, which, you know, I'm a flirty person sometimes in real life, so. Uh, and he pointed that out and asked me if Basti was okay with the fact that I was uh, sitting on another friend of mine's lap, which it was okay, just so you know. And that was that. And we all laughed and ha ha ha. And uh, I don't understand where this is coming from. I know people are just going to, you know, I don't know. Not believe me, because what the fuck do I know actually knowing someone in the real world and having experienced them, like, as a human being and, you know, knowing them more than anyone else in this fucking YouTube internet bullshittery, but, you know, what up? The deal is, he has a lot of enemies. A lot of people don't like him. He said things that bother certain people, which, you know, guess what? I'm a lot less controversial. Yes, occasionally I call myself a feminist. Until I realize that there's so many parts of this party I fucking hate or side that I'm starting to dislike, but whatever. And I'm just tired of it. I'm tired of hearing the same old crap about someone I know in the real world. Like, something I know is not fucking true. That's just it. That's just the fucking thing. I interact with this person all the fucking time. Often. And, like, like, stays at my house, unsupervised, with me, you know, I'm there, alone, nothing. Literally, like I say, walk in the shower in a towel, hang around in a t-shirt and panties. Like, no, no bullshit artists. And if you really want to, you know, ask a question about how he really is, or whatever the fuck it is, just go ahead. Ask me. I'll give you a fucking honest answer. If there's one thing I goddamn do in this channel is I fucking tell you how I feel. And this is how I honestly feel. This is bullshit. This is fucking bullshit. Alright? Caffeine Jedi fucking thinks this is bullshit. I am fucking taking my line here. Bullshit line. See? There it is. Alright? Alright, assholes. If you don't believe me, you can go suck a big giant cop. <laughs> Good night.